Hello, this is Comprehensive Math Science YouTube channel. Welcome to this channel. So in this video, you will be learning about finding the derivative of function x plus root under x plus 1 from first principle. Or you can say derivative of function of function x plus root under x plus 1 from the definition of derivative. Okay, for that uh, we need to suppose this function as y is equal to x plus root under x plus 1. Let this be equation 1. Okay, so x is variable here and y is function of x. To proceed further, we have to suppose uh, two increments for x and for y respectively. Uh, let del x is equal to k and del y is equal to h be small change in values or small increments in x and y respectively. The change in value of x causes change in value of y because I have already told you y is function of variable x. So change in value of x affects the value of y. Then equation 1 in terms of k and h or del x and del y can be written as y plus h is equal to x plus k plus root under x plus k plus 1. Let this be equation 2. So wherever there are variable and function there you have to write h or k depending or uh, depending on your supposition okay okay to proceed further we have to subtract equation 1 from this equation 2 and by subtracting equation 1 from equation 2 we have this y plus h minus y is equal to x plus k plus root under x plus k plus 1 minus x plus root under x plus 1 whole is whole bracket now after uh, cancelling y y here so h is equal to uh, here uh, uh, after opening this bracket we have x plus k plus root under x plus k plus 1 minus x minus uh, root under x plus 1 so here x and x cancel out so we are left with h is equal to k plus root under x plus k plus 1 minus root under x plus 1 so now here the increment in um, variable is k so dividing both sides by k okay we have h by k h divided by k is equal to k plus k plus root under x plus k plus 1 minus root under x plus 1 whole divided by k is here now taking limit as k tends to 0 Taking limit as k tends to 0, on both sides we have limit k tends to 0, h divided by k is equal to limit k tends to 0, k plus root under x plus k plus 1 minus root under x plus 1 whole divided by k is there. But we know from definition of first derivative, we know limit k tends to 0, h divided by k is equal to limit del x tends to 0 del y by del x actually h means del y and k means del x is equal to dy by dx which means uh, dy by dx means derivative of y with respect to x by definition of first principle of derivative now using uh, dy by dx in place of limit k tends to 0 h by k we have dy by dx is equal to limit k tends to 0 k plus root under x plus k plus 1 minus root under x plus 1 whole divided by k is here proceeding further limit k tends to 0 is there and and x k plus root under x plus k plus 1 minus x uh, root under x plus 1 divided by k okay if you use uh, k is equal to 0 directly here you get uh, 0 by 0 which is undetermined in minute form so to prevent this situation we have to multiply the numerator and denominator by k plus uh, by this term but this minus should be plus here okay so k plus root under, root under x plus k plus 1 plus root under x plus 1 whole divided by k plus root under x plus k plus 1 plus root under x plus 1 okay and supposing this uh, from this k to root under x plus k plus 1 as a and root under x plus 1 as b we can use it as the form of a square minus b square is equal to a minus b 
times a plus b so using this formula we have here after using the relation um, a minus b times a plus b is equal to a square minus b square here we get this term okay so limit k tends to 0 uh, k plus root under x plus k plus 1 whole square minus x plus 1 root under whole square whole divided by k times uh, k plus root under x plus k plus 1 plus root under x plus 1 okay to next line limit k tends to 0 is there and after opening this bracket as a plus b whole square we get k square plus 2 times k times root under x plus 1 plus k plus root under x plus 1 plus k square and minus uh, root under x plus 1 square is there whole divided by k plus root under x plus 1 plus x plus k plus 1 plus root under x plus 1 is there as it is <coughs> now limit k tends to 0 and uh, after opening and this bracket as well we have k square plus 2k uh, times root under x plus k plus 1 plus x plus k plus 1 minus x plus 1 all divided by remaining denominator is as it is okay limit tends uh, limit k tends to 0 now here uh, x x cancel out 1 1 cancel out okay after opening this bracket and we get limit uh, k tends to 0 k square plus k plus 2k times limit uh, root under x plus k plus 1 whole divided by k uh, times k plus root under x plus k plus 1 plus root under x plus 1 is equal to now uh, taking k common from here so in there are three terms and from each of three terms contain k here so we're taking k common here we get k plus 1 plus 2 times root under x plus k plus 1 here and divided by k times k plus root under x plus k plus 1 plus root under x plus 1 is there and k k cancel out here so limit k plus 0 time uh, 0 uh, limit k, k tends to 0 and k plus 1 plus 2 root under x plus k plus 1 divided by k plus root under x plus k plus 1 plus root under x plus 1 is there now at k is equal to 0 using k is equal to 0 over here we have uh, dy by dx is equal to 0 plus 1 okay 0 plus 1 plus 2 times root under x plus 0 plus 1 divided by 0 plus root under x plus 0 plus 1 plus root under x plus 1 okay your bracket is missing so you can add here bracket and after simplification we have 1 plus 2 times root under x plus 1 okay divided by root under x plus 1 plus root under x plus 1 okay these two terms are similar adding them uh, we have 1 plus 2 times x root under x plus 1 divided by 2 times root under x plus 1 okay this uh, denominator this denominator is for both one okay this denominator is both for one and two times root under x plus one so after separating them we get one divided by two times root under x plus one plus two times root under x plus 1 divided by root under 2 times root under x plus 1 and this is cancel out remaining is there 1 and 1 divided by 2 times x root under x plus 1 is there so dy by dx is equal to we got um, 1 plus 1 divided by 2 times root under x plus 1 is there so derivative of uh, x plus root under x plus 1 with respect to x For, from first principle we get 1 plus 1 divided by 2 times root under x plus 1 so this is how you can find the derivative of x plus uh, root under x plus 1 with respect to x from the first principle or you can say from definition of derivative. If you want this uh, file used in this video, you can go to the description and download it by clicking the link provided provided in the description okay so if you found this video helpful you can share it if you have any query you can leave the comment in comment section and 
don't forget to subscribe the channel if you are new to this channel thank you so much for watching see you in next video thank you so much